cool stuff and then have a ton of upgrades to get, right? Yeah. That's going to be really good. We're going to be super yep. powerful after this and still have no good anti-air. <laughs> Marines are pretty good. I just need to make them. Oh gosh, I don't, I, again, I don't remember exactly who gets what. It's like, I remember they were like Zeratul apprentices or something like that. And it is, I don't know, it's probably been changed since I played it anyway, but I'm sure it's still very difficult. Wasn't like Artanis one of Zeratul's apprentices? You just get to run out around as Artanis, because that seems pretty good. <laughs> no, I don't think it's Artanis, but I think it's just some no-name Dark Templar. I'm nervous about this one. Yeah, wasn't isn't this supposed to be Whispers of Oblivion? Did they change the name on us? Oh. Now it's I... Whispers of Doom. Apparently one has feedback and one has Shadow Fury. What the hell have you Which seems pretty good. Into? Yeah, I guess feedbacking uh overseers what is good. Ask of us? Do we have blink like all of us? I think we all get it, yeah. So could we do the speedrun strats? Where you blink through that crevasse? Because I, I can't I, do it. Yeah, I would do it if uh, if you know where it is and could show us. Oh yeah, this is going to be horrible. So we want to come over here. Then blink through here. Oh, it doesn't work anymore, I guess. You're supposed to be in normal wings. Uh, you can see there's a little hole there. You yeah, get yeah. vision to the other side and you can blink through. Oh, oh it, it works. Spore crawlers can detect my presence. I should stun them. Nice. Okay, so I got assault. Gains bonus attack speed for a short duration. So it's like a charge. I got feedback. Brings all damage from the targets. It deals one damage per point of energy. So we're gonna have to be real careful with these. Yeah. I can disable one detector. I think. Do we all have, we all have blink, right? Yes. Yes. So I think what we should do here is everyone blinks onto the left spore crawler, assassinates it, and I'll disable the right one. Okay. Three, right. two, one, go. Get the get the other one. Get the other get the one. Other... Very nice. Oh, you guys don't do very much damage. Uh, excuse me, forty-seven point nine nine. I'll have you know. Wow. I'm glad that it's discounted. <laughs> uh, I can disable in the sack. It's on cooldown. Oh, so this my ability is basically like a stim pack. That overseer can see through my cloak. I best you can feed back overseers, by the way. Nice. Crossing this chasm. If we were playing on a normal difficulty, you would kill them in one shot. I will comply. I just have, like, ignore this stuff and yeah. The first fragment of the prophecy. Soon all will be made clear. It doesn't really matter, Alstabert. As long as you Why live, or er, wait, I don't need this chat for this. <laughs> you get fifty more HP than us. I, am the blade of I earned fifty so more HP than you. That's one way to look at it. Yeah. I worked hard for that. Oh. Whoa. We're getting major slowdown. Oh no, it's energy. Uh, oh. You there, buddy? Oh, oh no. I think we're back. Okay, yeah, I'm back. I'm back. I think so. Yeah, it seems okay. 
So I have to ask, why don't I get any units? I don't know. It's because we're just the apprentices, so we get the extra power, I guess. Oh, I feel kind of Are there normally rocks here? I, am yeah, I guess not. Very nice. Uh, sorry, it's on cooldown. I can't. Oh, no. Sorry, I'm like losing track of which one is mine. <laughs> uh, we can jump on the spore caller now. Okay. This is bullying. So Poor the next part is Broodlord, be careful. Yes. <laughs> you still haven't you still didn't get any. Yeah, I, I'm the solo man. I'm doing the deathless runs. Here, let's pull them way back. Just send one in. And he should now he should float Once it's forward. Back, I can void prison, but... Yep. Oh my gosh, this stupid guy. He's going hold position, dude. Okay, this is easy. There's one more brood up there. You get on Void Prisoner now. Got it. Okay. So it looks like your guys are actually allowed to die, your little apprentices. Ooh, yeah. We shouldn't test it, but it's not the end of the world. I assume we we also still get healed when uh, we get to the shrines. I think so, yeah. I always leave the stalkers in the back for this. If you lose all the stalkers for this part, then air units won't come. Oh, really? That's interesting. Yeah, well, they'll come, and then uh, they'll just, like, leave. It's all very odd. Huh. Okay. One stalker down, and I think we get it back anyway, so... I can't believe they don't give you any. The Queen of Blades I know, it's it's so rude. Here. She seeks to subvert this sacred world. I shall put an end to that plan. I think you can target the Muta and just pull the boy or the brute back. I almost have Void Prison. Very well. Very nice. Again, I don't remember exactly how this was when I played it the first time, but I, I just remember it being like a nightmare. So this seems fine, <laughs> comparatively. Well, we're also pretty decent. I don't know who you played with before. That's true. But you didn't have synergy. <laughs> That's true. Or the person who, you know, played the game without losing any units. Did I lose a stalker? I think I lost one. That upsets me. The second fragment of the prophecy. My task is nearly complete. The prophecy. Your hope is an illusion, old fool. The prophecy was that Kerrigan would be the one to bring balance to the force, right? <laughs> Something like that. I'll never give up so long as hope remains. Awesome. Careful now. 
Perrigan has set guards to bar our way. It could be a trap. We should take them out carefully, one at a time. Oh, Lord. No risk being overwhelmed. Oh, don't you watch your DT? I can disable detection in a sec. It's funny, like, I have this. My ability is like this assault, like, stim pack, and it, it makes me do almost as much damage as Zeratul, but it's still not very good. <laughs> still pretty bad. This you is the Banelings, right? Fancy warp blade. The Banelings spew acid when they die. I would leave the DTs back. Take them out from a distance. Yeah, this part's all up to you guys. Uh, split your stalkers. Get, you get blink across, yeah, and then you can blink back. Oh god, they turned around! Whoa. Oh! Wow, there were, there's more than usual, so it doesn't quite work as, as well. That was pretty rough. This hatchery must be destroyed. If I this hatch seems pretty easy. Okay, good. This land. Should I bring the stalkers or not even bother? I don't think so. We can take down, or can we take down the detection? Because one of it is an overseer. Um, why don't we snipe? Yeah, snipe, snipe that like typical. I think we just have so many stalkers. It's okay. I think there's an ultra here. There might be two actually. I think it's two. Let's just get the overseer like normal and then we can jump the the void or the you know. Nice job. Perfect. We are one with the shadows. Intriguing. What would you ask of us? I still can't believe that dream. <laughs> That's the only thing I'd, I'd ask to be changed, is like, give poor player one a stalker or something. <laughs> I'm having fun. That's good. I actually want plus one damage so I can kill the Hydras in one shot. Leaving them at one HP seems... it feels bad. <laughs> That's the 80% damage reduction. Oh yeah, good point. I've never actually seen them root before. I think there's more than usual here. Well, I also usually just run past this part. <laughs> yeah. I feel like this part should be easy. I hope so. I'm also kind of nervous about the escape, getting to the very end and then, you know. I think that'll be okay, too. Especially if your guys are allowed to die, I'm the only one that needs to live. Yeah, yeah. No problem. So every man for himself, just get to the end however you need to get to the end? Oh, I was thinking everyone would be a bodyguard for me. Oh, yeah, that would be fine, too. can you destroy the airborne, sir? So we can do the cheese for the final hatchery. There's cheese for it? Yeah, you can put Zeratul to get vision and shoot it from the low ground with stalkers. Uh, okay, cool. That'll save time. Definitely more mutas have been added to this whole this whole section. So don't activate the thing. It's easier here. Or rather, you can't do it otherwise. Yeah. I, I doubt that we can even do it. You might be right looking at this. No, I think it'll be okay. The Queen of Blades seeks to pervert this world. Yeah, easy peasy. Look at all those broodlings. <laughs> Excuse me, they're swarmlings? 
Hmm. I don't know why. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Get your lore correct. <laughs> All of Kerrigan's hatcheries are destroyed. Blizzard spent millions of dollars coming up with these names, and you need to respect them. <laughs> Confirmed. The apprentice cannot activate the beacon. The final piece of the prophecy. It speaks of one who shall break the cycle of the gods. Hang on, I gotta click my Most chat chest. Thoughts. Okay, now I can skip. Here we go. All right, let's do this. I must get to the Void Seeker before the Zerg overwhelm me and the prophecy is lost. Blink down past, yeah. I think you're just faster than us. I'm not 100% sure, but... Zeratul remembered his Nikes. <laughs> Well, that was easy. Yep. Stalker, no! Oh, no. My Duplicate dude, your guy into the thing, though! No. Uh, name? Yes. Okay. <laughs> hey! Woohoo! You're getting trolled right there. We weren't sure if he needed to survive, but let's just pretend he did and we made it. <laughs> Those interns might be unpaid, but we'll keep them alive. <laughs> Uh, I'm not even going to bother with this until we finish these. Yeah, good point. You going to give me orders? All in all, that went pretty well. Next mission will be fun. Just to confirm, Synergy's guy did survive. He blinked out with, like, red health left. Yep. Yep. It's cannon. I'm a little nervous about uh, In Utter Darkness. Just a little nervous. There's three of us. There's three lanes. It seems fine to me. That's mm. math. It's true. So one thing I've noted with In Utter Darkness in general, though, is it's a lot easier if you know how to use Psystorm. Oh, yeah. And I figure with less things to focus on. I mean, there's going to be more stuff, but less focus, which means we should be able to size storm really well. All right, Zeratul, old buddy. I think so. You. Also, I would assume that he probably put in um, detection in the earlier ways, but you can do like half of the mission just with DTs for the most These part and the Phoenix you get, but you. I assume that he put in yeah, Overseers earlier, intact, yeah. if I had to guess. Power, they would be functional. There's a lot of gas geysers. Oh, we each get two. What a blessing. Oh, it's yours. I thought I got three. Uh, don't mind if I do steal these buildings. <laughs> oh, I'm well, green um... this time. I wonder if we can bug out the hybrid. Because there's a couple positions that, because the hybrid always teleports behind a target, you can kind of bait him into a position and get him stuck. I'm willing to try that for sure. I'm willing to try anything for that. I haven't, see, I, I, I tend to play every game like super legit and I'm really boring and don't do any fun like goofy strats. So if you, if you know anything that you think could make these easier, I'm down for it. Well, I didn't intend to learn that, but I was being forced by stream chat to play this on Brutal with Mass Archon only, and things were just going terribly with the Archon Pro Push. And then uh, he just blinked into a corner and got himself stuck. <laughs> sure, just blame stream chat. I absolutely will, because they blame me. <laughs> and you, yeah, you got all the buildings, even though I powered them. <gasps> Can we power each other's buildings? You got one gateway. I, well, I built that. Because I'm a oh. self-starter. The preservers you seek serve a higher power now, Dark One. Probably should have powered that cannon. You have not enough power. Higher power. 
I think I'm gonna go Stalkers. Okay. I think this is gonna be my niche as being the mobility force. Okay, so there's this one stalker as just <laughs> being an asshole. I'm trying to make a stalker, I promise. The mighty spirits of the servers are in prison close by. We must find Thank you. Them. Yeah, get him blow. We are the flame. High Templar are really good on this mission too, because you can feedback Mar and make him pretty much useless. I'm being told that we can make scouts in Utter Darkness, and I might do that. Mass scouts? Do they still cost 275 minerals? They better. Because <laughs> that's where the scout memes really begin. It's what the scout's about. I played a, a Brood War mod. Um, that's pretty difficult, but he modified the tech tree and made the scout cheaper. And it's actually really good when it's not as expensive. You can just, like, make mass scouts and beat, like, I think someone else who was playing the mod beat, like, almost every Protoss mission with only scouts. It's awesome. Nice. So I have a feeling we're going to be multi-pronged a lot. Yes. Someone should probably focus on Immortals. Uh, I'll do that. And then I just kind of feel like someone should also be Dark Templar once we get them. Or Zealot Archon. Let me get my... Well... Who gets the... Okay, so you get the, the tech structures for free. Us plebs oh. have to pay for them. Your small loan of I a million dollars. I was hoping you would get it. So Mar is roasting us. Yeah, he's pretty good. He's. I think he's stronger at the first. The first iteration here. Well, normally he has 400, 400, and oh. this time he has 750, 1500. You can't help but laugh at that. Like, come on. <laughs> Why? <laughs> I think that he also does more damage. Did you get a free immortal? No. What the heck? Okay, well, I have an immortal being built, but it's going to take a while. Well, he has 17 kills. Just going to wait for the Dark Protoss to come and clean us up, you know? Oh, why did you say that? Because <laughs> I knew it would come true. <laughs> no, Immortal, no! I think we might die here. Well, I know for next time not to power your buildings. I thought you would get them. I did too. I was really excited. I was like, I was going to steal the buildings from you two, but no. The game strikes back. How do you beat the Zealot? <laughs> Zealot's too strong. They're 2-2. Two, two. I have two Immortals coming out. If we can survive this, we can we can hey we can hang on, boys. Can we? <laughs> I mean Synergy's about to lose his Nexus. Oh, let's go! How much do you think he's going to get buffed per wave? I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> well, really good job. The hybrid is draining the preservers to survive. 
I must free them before it is too late. I don't know if either of you guys were here for this, but when I was playing the uh, Synergy's Race Swap version of this, I just built a barracks and floated it over to the preservers. I saw that. Yeah, that was that was great. I wish we could do that here. Just uh, get the Spear of a Dune to warp in a pylon over there. Get warp gate. Yeah. Okay, well, hold on to your butts with Mar. He's the same toughness he was last time, which is good. Okay, okay. He just started at max strength, I guess. Is it me or is he very tiny? Well, he gets bigger as he powers up, but maybe not well, in this version. Well, we got a little bit of Mini-Mar going on. <laughs> I think even tinier than normal. <laughs> Whew. Okay, let's get the DTs. Okay. You're stealing my minerals again. I tried to wall it out, wall it off. I'll, I'll do it again. You're, you're stealing my minerals also. I'll have you know. It's a loan. Now, they can still get through. I don't... Mm. It doesn't matter. I'm just going to keep putting pylons in here. Is restored, it could be of great value to us. Okay, cool. I think I think oh. we're separated now. Okay, you got the DTs. So the DT should really help against the non-Mar attacks? Yes, definitely. Because I don't think they send detection. Not in the original, but I've learned not to count my chickens. Uh, if you have enough anti-air, I think maybe we want to go for that side base for the High Templar. Sounds good. We can always pull back if it's a nightmare. And we'll get Synergy of Gas dump then, which would be yes. good. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that's real bad against scouts. Oh. Ugh. Oh, no. Well, it was a nightmare. These borders hurt. Yes. I'll start making some stalkers too. And Mara's back. I return to serve. Now, obviously, we're putting in an A for effort here. But, like you were saying earlier, it's like, if you don't get a good start, you just are cut, like, we're really clawing our way back from this one. Yeah, I figure if we can do it, we should. But if we lose, don't take it personally. Right. It was just a real bad start. I guess maybe just turtle? I don't... Yeah. So how bad was that base? I didn't really get to see it because I pulled back for the voids. Well, they had High Templar in there, which stormed us, and there's really no way in except those tight chokes. Um, they had a bunch of stalkers, but I think that was part of an attack wave. Okay. So I think it was reasonable. We could bring DTs with us to protect us from zealots. What I might do is send a DT to kind of... S oh, they have a cannon there. Yeah, never mind. Yeah, both sides. All right, Mars starting to 
level up his HP now. Actually, wait. Oh, no, that's he's worse. No, he's worse. He's he's weaker. Okay. He was 750 shields, 100 or 1,500 HP. Yeah. <laughs> well. Nice. Sure. Maybe we should try pushing again. Okay. Yeah, there's very limited windows between this. Just be careful with the stalkers, because we gotta... I'm sure there's void rays in this base. Yeah, I'm just gonna try to pull stuff out. Yeah, that's... Just a lot of zealots, honestly. eventually. Oh my god, <laughs> these scouts! Scouts are fine, they only do 10 damage. Mars incoming though. Okay. Killed one gateway. Every little bit. I think we'll be able to bust the space. Yep. Right after this. <laughs> Where were those units even sitting prior to this? My stock accounts are very low. But there's no more air. It's okay. Sorry, I was focused on the base. Okay, this base is crippled, and I don't know if they're going to even bother rebuilding it or not, so we should be okay. Wow. 3-2-3 three, three stalkers are way better than 1-1 one, one stalkers. Yeah. Okay, he got a big buff this time. Now he's 14-14. Seems a little random whether he's going to be stronger or not. So half of the attack waves are gone, right? Because they don't attack from the main base. Correct. Well, they, random zealots just kind of popped out there. I don't know what that was about. Oh, maybe I'm wrong. Or they might have, like, one powered gateway. Uh, I... Yeah, maybe further down. I mean, it should be easy to go and destroy A that now. Prism. Here it is. Oh, look! Oh, interesting. Now they got War Prisms in their base now, too. Uh, there are there are uh, units on top of the shrine. There are two archons. That's okay. You don't have detection, so it shouldn't be a problem. Yep. There we go. Mars almost here, though. Okay. Uh, I think the units in this base have bully triggers set. Uh, we have to destroy everything or they're going to keep coming. So let me just break this. I'll come up behind Mar. Okay, I'll do my best. Okay, cool. So there's the High Templar. I'm going to I'm gonna get that. Again, just being able to feedback Mar is super useful. Oh, gosh. Oh, wow. So many. Uh, Synergy, could you send the DTs to help out Jabrina's base? Yeah. 
My probes can't flee because they're walled in. <laughs> He's got so many DTs though, it might be okay. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. Uh, immortal count's gonna be low for a while. Stalker count is one. I could be friends with, with the, three HP. The one immortal. Our mineral patches don't have that much on them, by the way. Right. I took this expo, but it's going to be tight. This whole mission is going to be real tight. Um, I really want a high Templar. If we can just... I have one finished. Okay, I was going to say, just feedback Mar. That helps a lot. I mean, not damage-wise, but now he can't cast anything. So it looks like he does have the Plasma Blast from Legacy of the Void. That hits for, I think, 300. Okay. So he's basically a hybrid dominator on top of a Mar. <laughs> on top of a Mar. Mars on Mars. They're still replacing, yep, they're still replacing those zealots in this base. Those bully triggers need to be disabled once the base is destroyed. Is there some building we missed? No, I think it's, it's it, pre-placed units just have a bully trigger where they'll just rebuild them endlessly, and I bet on this difficulty it's set to be, like, infinite. Gotcha. That's my guess. We need those resources, though, and as I get more, I can start giving it to you all. So what are we going to do about the base on the west? Do we think we can kill it, or would it be too far no. out of the way? Oh, wow. Oh, look at the size of this. Oh, dear. It seems like they stopped reinforcing at the other base, though. That's something. That's good, because they just size stormed your workers. Uh, oh my god. It's a nightmare. I'm not loving having my resource line this close to this ramp. <laughs> Not pleasant. How... Do you think we can cheese the end? Uh, if you can so, get DTs through there, then usually yes. Exactly. I was kind of thinking that we might be in a bad enough shape that if we pull the boys, pull everything just to get Synergy's DTs across... That might be our best choice because this doesn't. Yeah. I mean, maybe we're more okay than I think we are, but I feel like we're in real bad shape. No, I completely agree. I think that we're gonna need um, a bold, unstoppable plan, or it's just gonna be a long, slow death. So we might as well do it after we All right, kill let's him. Let's do it. Oh yeah, let's go around the right side. Okay, cool. That's Let Mar fight. attack our base. I'll bring expansion All the boys. boys. Let's go. I have about 15 DT, so if we get them through, they should be able to take down the prison. Yes. And I have an, I have this nexus off to the side, so if he does kill our whole base, I think we would still be okay. Like, no defeat trigger, I should say. Oh my... Not the boys! Not the boys! Wow. No! A lot of extra pre-play stuff here. All right, let's just. I let's can't just, kill the void. We have to go. Yeah, just just right-click back there, and we'll run interference for you. I don't think it's going to work. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, one got through. Two got through. Three. Perfect. Okay, you're gonna have to micro well. Be so careful. 
Make sure that you do not kill one, because Mar will recall as soon as you kill one. So okay. get them all very low at the same time. <laughs> the gentleman's 39.99 damage. Oh, I don't know if the, I, that top one might be covered. Oh, no, you're right. It might be possible to hit it, pull back, hit it, pull back. It's a nail I'm going to assume they don't have mobile detection. Okay. Uh, right to the south of the cannon, yeah. No! No! Ah! Maybe a little bit to the south and right? Like, kind of... Oh, you could kill the Archon. I think you can kill the Archon from below it. Uh, how strong is Mar? He's still 1400, 1400. So he starts out super strong and actually gets weaker. And then gets a little bit stronger, but not much compared to where he was at the beginning. Your allies are in battle. Is under attack. <gasps> yeah, I think I got We're going to yes. do it. And by we, I mean synergy. Oh, gosh. Can oh. they destroy our whole base yeah, before? I'm hiding a probe. I played enough PvP to know how this goes. Uh, okay, there we go. Is under Your allies are in Our is under Humorously enough, that High Templar has vision and won't storm. <laughs> so the difficult part is going to be getting the kills at the end because Mar might lift. Actually, you should wait, okay? So don't bust it yet. I'm going to make a, a High Templar and feedback him so he won't have energy to lift you. Oh, okay. yeah. Okay, there are one hit from dying. One hit, there you go. Oh. Okay, the High Templar is halfway done. I think it's gonna finish. <laughs> oh. Unless he depowers it. And remember that Mar hits really, really hard, so go around the outside because he's also slow. Come on, five seconds. Come on. Go on! Yes! Yes! Okay, Got go, him. go, go. Let him move. Let him move. Yes, he's going away. He's going away. Okay. No, no. Energy. Let's go! You are a god. Actual human god. Wow. wow. That was amazing. I know you all in chat didn't think we were going to do it, but Synergy pulled it out. You didn't think! <laughs> that we had the gumption. When in doubt, the boys come out. <laughs> that was a real dream. <laughs> that's one of those that like I'll be about to fall asleep tonight at like 1230 and I'll just remember this incredible moment <laughs> that's one of the ones you're going to be telling your grandkids about in 40 years <laughs> oh. I wish we could clip that but that, that was like a that was like a full 10 minute adventure yeah, that's like a compilation that gets made. So, do you think maybe for this one it would be best if one person exclusively just stayed home 100% of the time? Maybe. I assume I'm the one that's going to have Zeratul. Mm -hmm. I wonder if you can do the speedrun strap. Because we could be in and out in three minutes. Uh, but we want the bonuses. We could be in and out in three minutes and 15 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to just try it, why don't we just try it? And uh, if it doesn't work, then we can start again. Yeah, sounds good. So why don't the way we do it is uh, like synergy goes to the north bonus. You go to the east bonus and I'll try to do the 
rest of the stuff. Okay. I must find a way to establish a foothold. Oh, apprentices are here, boys. To keep the Zerg at bay. The Phantom. They have vision. I will. Ah, this faithful observer has kept watch since the evacuation. Its abilities will certainly prove useful now. Some of these abandoned structures remain functional. We shall make use of them. This ancient beacon still thrums with power. So it looks like you get the observer, Jabri, now. So I might need you to help spot. I think we each got one, actually. Oh, cool. Oh, I've heard take. Okay, I'm going to take my Colossus. Did you get one? Yes, okay. Yes. Until we are dead. Yes. I must find the Overmind's cortex and discover what I can from it. This isn't going to work. <laughs> Is it all different? These warp gates appear uh, to be functional. I, it, it probably Perhaps won't work, but you know what? Chance. We got to believe. Yeah, we might as well try it. The first overmine tendril. I sense pain. Surprise. Death. I always liked how Zeratul's like, I sense death is standing next to a thing that has been dead for, like, ever. He's not the greatest prophesizer, honestly. <laughs> we can scout the area before putting ourselves at risk. The second overmind tendril. Oh, I think I just got Yeah. And I have a huge wave of silence. He's got two. He got two already. How are the researchers oh. doing? Um, it's very difficult to get through because we get hit by much larger attacks earlier. So I can't use the Colossus gotcha. to do much. You must construct additional pylons. Um, oh yeah, the, that doesn't work. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I guess we're playing it semi-legit. Yeah, I think you are correct. I, we can get the first two at least. And then we'll only have to do half the map. Okay. Because I can absolutely just go back from get those first two and then head back home and it'd be easy peasy. Mm -hmm. 